nom 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 nom. All right. Whoever may be out there, welcome to our final live stream this weekend. Anyway, of Defiance, Heartbreaker. It's not moving. I've got to reset that. There we go. We go. Am I moving? There we go. Now nah, we're moving. We are at Shandu's consulate, as I mentioned in yesterday's live stream, or the live stream previous to this. If you're watching recordings, we are going to call down, or at least attempt to call down, a major arc ball, aka arc break. This a testing session of the DLC. First of all, let's see what we've got here. I've got two spikes. So we need four spikes. Let's see what we got here. Uh, my flashbangs. I got them as some reward. Do I have? Okay, don't have the weekly yet. Weeklies probably come on Monday. So we've got an ammo spike. We're full on ammo spikes. Ooh. There's a nice machine gun there. We will claim that guy for the time being. And of course, we will claim our daily Arc Hunter reward. Which will give us a spike. Or battery, actually. Arc spike battery. Take those, because we'll sell those. We don't use flashbangs. And the rest of those can hold off for weapon leveling. So let's run up here real quick. Now, in the previous live stream previous episode, however you want to term it, we did go into a minor arc break. Power stem. You know what, I got to see... And of course, uh, late last night we were able to do some major arc falls, which I recorded and have up on YouTube. So, and I also did another minor arc fall, so we get to see the conclusion of the minor arc fall, which I was not able to do. Power stems, so I do need power stems. Ah, oh, sweet. I'll complete that, so we will buy those guys. Yes, I do. Thank you. So I am now upgraded to blue. And this one doesn't sell me the... Grenades, which I think I'm... Okay, I'm full up on grenades, but I do want to sell. I did want to check my shields here. I can definitely have 1618, it's 1626, 10, 6. So I can finally get rid of that guy, because he's not good. See, I don't like not having the comparison there. Being able to compare after about. Yes, I do. 1084, 76, 10, just slower recharge a lot more. We'll hold on to that for the time being. And in the second major arc fall we did, uh, I got that as a reward. So apparently you do get a, there are a lot of oranges that are handed out. Of course it's all RNG, so uh, depending on how many people you get. It'll depend on how many oranges are actually handed out. The first major I completed I did not get an orange. So this that came from the second one. So from the people I was with, uh, the way they were talking, um, odds are you do a couple of them, two, three, you're probably at least going to get at least one orange. Some people ended up with four, as I recall, out of one of them. Okay. I also want to get rid of at this point. As you can see, all my favorites are not part of the things to sell. So 
so don't have to worry about selling by accident. I'm gonna compare my shields here. 1022. Hurricane is better overall, except for recharge delay. I like that recharge delay though, so you know what? We'll hold on to them for the time being. Is anything happening here? Nobody's talking, so we might end up having to drop this arc fall by ourselves. Just to see what it's like going through solo. And there she is by Bloodbath. Minor Arcfall, anything else going on? Diablo Vaccine, Chinatown, and Bulge Swarm, Bulge Swarm. So we'll pop on over to Bloodbath. Oh, I gotta buy my clusters anyway. So I gotta fill up on grenades. Now what stims do I have? Power stim. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna wanna go to my... So I still need blue protection and blue ammo spikes to finish off that pursuit. But, let's do this. Pursuit complete. I will want my heal stim. Uh, my damage spike. Uh, I don't know if I can do damage or protection. Hmm. Hmm. That's a good question. Heal stim. Yeah, I'm not spending 2,000 credits for the heal stim. Hopefully I'm not going to uh, derp my um, microphone this time. As I mentioned in the description for the video, nothing, no vital information I imparted while my mic was derped. But uh, I think I did mention that um, as part of the DLC you get these arc spikes. And if you have the DLC, you can call down the uh, arc spikes. Um, so you can only call them down if you buy the DLC. However, anybody can enter them. But if you do not have the DLC, you cannot use the arc spikes. Uh, and you not, cannot call down these arc falls. You have to wait till somebody who has the DLC calls it down. And you come across the arc fall. Cluster grenade, I do want. Yes, thank you. So we're going to go to our cluster. So we'll leave the damage spike up. Keep our heal stims to help us. We got our heavy assault carbine and our thunder. Which doesn't have a yellow roll. Interesting. So, again, that, as I mentioned yesterday, um, with the cold fire weapons, that's sort of along the same lines. Um, people who don't have the DLC can get the cold fire weapons, they can trade them, they can sell them, they can salvage them, but they can't use them. Same thing here with the arc breaks. Um, you can go in them, you can get the rewards from them, you can participate in, in them. If you do not have the DLC, but you need the DLC in order to actually call them down. Now when you do call them down, they will appear on the map as the normal icon. 
just the site itself is the small icon, but once they're called down, uh, see if anybody's called any down, they will appear this way, but the name will be different. You can see Mutant Conflict, that's a typical normal arc fall claim jumpers. Um, if you're familiar with the game Prosperity 99, these are all the names of the uh, typical normal arc falls. Dark matter obliteration, dark matter obliteration, extractors, obliteration. So all these are your normal arc falls. Oh, I'm surprised we don't have a major up. Interesting. But you will notice a difference. And if you um, watch uh, the YouTube video of the minor arc fall that I have on my channel, uh, you'll actually see on the map where I was looking for it. And um, that was by the crater. In that area, somebody had already called that down, so I didn't get the uh, the first part, the exterior fighting, but he was able to go inside. In fact, I was able to go inside twice and complete the inter interior twice. So that might be a nice little perk, something to remember, that when you call down these arc falls, if you can complete the interior in a relatively short amount of time, you exit, and then when you exit, if the arc fault is still running, so to speak, because once once the arc fault interior pops up, once you're able, once you complete the exterior and you're able to enter the interior, there is a timer. Uh, I'll have to go back into videos to watch exactly how much time it is. In fact, we'll probably see right here um, if I manage to survive the exterior battle for this major. Um, there will be a timer that starts running. It, and that's to give people time to get there and get into the interior. So it's probably 15 minutes. So if you can complete the interior uh, before the 15 minutes run runs out, you can exit the arc fall. You're you're ported directly back outside the arc fall again once you're done. Once you exit from the interior, and you can run back in and complete the interior again. So that's what I did. And that, so that's what we showed on that minor arc fall from last night. That's on the YouTube. I was actually go in there at the last part of the interior there were already people in there so I was thrown in their group we completed it real fast I got the rewards popped back out went back in with another group of people who went back in as well and we completed it again so that's a nice little uh, thing if you got a nice organized group you can bang out a couple of these from one arc fall which is awesome especially for the rewards we got after doing the, f the full interior the second time some nice drops so let's pop on over to the site. I guess it would help if I made sure I knew how to get there. Which way am I going? Where's my beacon? There's my beacon. Okay. Let's go. So this session will... You know what? Uh, I don't want to have to run back, do I? So I'm probably going to end up calling this down myself, so we'll do first and foremost make sure we got four arc spike batteries to call it down if nobody else joins us we just need one please bye for 10,000 script badding okay so now we got enough batteries to call this puppy down We will call that down. I'm detecting an incoming arc fall. I have high hopes for this, but let's be careful. There are people here who need to be rescued. Oh, thank you. That way. Back this way. Keep forgetting there's that little part right here. We gotta go up there. We gotta come on. Lackies, that was the first debut. Potential. 
Fireball site detected. We got a spike here. Figures we didn't need that, but that's all right. That done. Of course, we completed this one by calling down the minor arc fall yesterday and then helping with that first major. Spike driver side, just gotta get the blue protection ammo spikes at some point. Don't worry about episodes, I think, because I actually was able to get my plague. So we did beat him twice, so this is similar to land the kill shot. We established a link, but additional arc spikes are needed to boost the signal. So they're gonna have to update that to say land the kill shot on Volge Warmaster so you can complete that. Enemy groups obviously doesn't change. Multiplayer wouldn't have changed ego evolution, I don't think it's changed at all. Combat is not changed that I recall from looking at previously. So the only other one was the social. Rise of the clans. Unfortunately we're not gonna be able to test that, I think, this go around. We'll have to see if we can get some more people in. Established a link, but additional arc spikes are needed to boost the signal. few more we might actually be able to pin this off when we did uh, for my recordings for my YouTube uh, videos I got up right now we um, 
both instances we went in with about 12 to 14 people. Four, five.
Protocol successfully redirected. Clear impact site. Ever to read. This will be interesting.
Come on, load up, ya little bugger. I wonder where this leads to.
don't know what we'll encounter here. Wow, I think he needs to be beefed up just a bit. 